my channel if you're new. My name is Nicole Heisman. I'm excited to be showing y'all an empty apartment tour of my new apartment in Silicon Valley, California. So if you're interested to see what my three bedroom open floor plan in sunny Menlo Park looks like, let's go. So you walk in the front door and there is a hallway to your right and a hallway going forward. So we'll start with the hallway on the right. Here we have our washer and dryer, which is really nice because not all the apartments we were looking at had washer dryer in unit. And then there is a extra closet, which we did not know about. So we are happy to have the extra storage. And then coming over here is the master bedroom. So it's a nice long hallway opening up into this bright room. I love that the walls are this white color. I think it makes the space look so much more open. And it does have in unit air conditioning, which again in California isn't always guaranteed. So it's really nice. <laughs> Forgive the echoes. It is very empty in here. Each room has its own thermostat, which I love so that me and my husband don't have to fight over how the entire apartment is heated and cooled. So our bed will probably go against this wall and we will put a TV on the opposite wall. One thing I really love about these wall sockets is that they actually have USB ports in them, which I just think is so handy so you don't have to have a wall adapter. The master closet in this bedroom is very roomy. This will be my husband's closet uh, because I will have one in my office and just nice and roomy. And then we go into the master bathroom. Hey, and I just love how open and wide this sink is. Plenty of drawers and this opens into like a medicine cabinet. Then you have the shower, which has this amazing rainfall shower head. It has this amazing waterfall shower head into a somewhat roomy shower. It doesn't have a bath, which I like, and it has built-in shelves in the wall. It has this weird like towel hook thing on the door, but it's at like the handle level. It's not up here to hang something high. I couldn't fit a robe on it, but it's there. <laughs> Coming back down this hallway, this will be my office. So I picked this because it's nice and bright. It is a little smaller than the master, but it opens into just another really bright room. Again, it has its own uh, heating and cooling unit, but the best part is actually the closet. You'll notice how much brighter it is because there's actually a window in the closet. Now I don't imagine I'll ever put this screen up, the shade up, but it is just nice because it keeps the room nice, bright, and open. And then you have a very similar bathroom, same shower situation, except this one has an additional storage shelves. And it has a little bit smaller of a vanity, but it still has that medicine cabinet. And this will primarily be the bathroom that I use because in our old home, we had his and her sinks. So we're very used to having our own sink situation and I just think it'll be easiest if I keep everything in here. So going out here, we have this really great open floor plan with these beautiful corner windows into our kitchen. This isn't completely empty because I had to put my bag somewhere, <laughs> but it has lots of storage space, lots of cabinets, and we are still figuring out how we're going to put the dining room table. We're actually thinking it might go like in the middle of the kitchen. And then you have this gorgeous open den space that leads onto the balcony. So we will likely put our couch here in front of the window and then put our TV and our media console on this wall. And before I take you outside to show you the balcony, I'll go ahead and show you the third room. This is where my husband's office will be because it gets the least amount of light and he likes a really dark office. So it is the smallest of all three rooms, but it does have its own closet and some mirrors that make it feel a little bit bigger. And this will be used for storage for the both of us or extra office space because his main closet will be in our bedroom. 
And lastly, we have, this is the open bathroom. So if we have guests over, they can come in here. This one actually has a tub instead of just a shower situation. And again, it has the medicine cabinet and a nice large vanity. So I'll go ahead and show you one of the best parts about this house, about this apartment, which is the balcony, nice and open. And it looks onto the dog park, which I think is so perfect. Cap's gonna love that. And then there is additional bike storage or just anything outdoorsy. It's not climate controlled, so we'll be careful what we put in here. And that is our new apartment. I can't wait to show it to y'all finished and furnished and decorated and just much nicer. But thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to give it a huge thumbs up. It really helps you as a small content creator. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click that bell icon to get notified every time I upload a new video, which is Mondays and Tuesdays, mixture of vlogs and regular videos. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.